this is, I believe, the third moving vlog. So you saw the apartment tours and then the moving prep, moving day. But here we are, just got back from Costa Rica. I got my hair done this morning. It's the new year and I have so much stuff to do in this apartment. I'll give you guys an update, but I found a storage unit on Facebook Marketplace for $20 and it looks, oh, that's backwards. It looks functional enough. Um, I just don't have any storage units. And also if I wanted this to be in the main room, um, it doesn't have to be like hidden away. It's a cute little storage unit. So anyways, I am going to pick that up and I figured that I could bring you guys along. I will say I wouldn't encourage anyone to go get Facebook Marketplace stuff by themselves. I've given the address and the name of the person I'm going to to a couple different people. That's my safety tip for you. And I'm all bundled up because it's so cold outside. I'm gonna put my Uggs on and then we're gonna go. It's in Hell's Kitchen, so we're headed uptown. Oh, I'm getting uncomfortably hot right now. alive I ended up calling my brother which made me feel better when I was going up but it has a bit of um, residue I knew when I bought this it was in the description so I'm gonna try to get it off with a magic eraser and then just for my floors I'm gonna put these felt tips on the bottom so it doesn't scrape the wood floors and something I am so excited. I um, did a gift swap with some YouTube gals and Brooke Michio had me and she got me the Our Place pan. It just came in. Here's the pan. And I actually had a Our Place at my last apartment. It did me well, but then I kind of stopped treating it. I got lazy, basically. So I'm gonna be treating this one very well. Here's the pan. Comes with a little steamer, which is great for veggies. This is reminding me I have to figure out what I'm doing for dinner. And then, of course, the top, and then it comes with a wooden little spatula thing and then sponge that you're supposed to use. I'm probably just gonna store it. I think I'm gonna try to really just use that one. Like, you can even make pasta in it, so. And try to do that, and there you have it. Thank you, Brooke. I'm so excited. All right, I figured we might as well do some more PR. I don't have that much stuff. We have <gasps> my mom made it. All right, first is the jacket. Oh, damn, this is heavy. Beautiful puffer jacket. I don't have any light puffers. All right, next we have this adorable pleated skirt. I feel like no companies get pleated skirts, right? But I really have faith, as long as this fits me, that it's gonna be perfect. And then I got a little set. This little one piece, cute. So cute, it's this floral. All right, next up, we have Vital Proteins Collagen Creamer and Collagen Peptides. This is very thoughtful, but I don't eat collagen. So I will be gifting this to friends and family who will enjoy it. Good morning, guys. I don't even know what day it is. Wednesday, I have so much stuff I have to do, so I'm going to a cafe. I can't do work in my own space. It just has never worked for me. We got the goods here. iPad, laptop, chargers, journal. This is my favorite oh, lip thing right now. It is the Dior Addict Lip Glow in Plum. It's beautiful. Um, and then a snack and some other stuff. And I'm gonna put it in this nice Kriana bag and then get going. 
Hi guys, I'm sorry I didn't vlog when I was out. It was a very productive morning. It's only two o'clock, but finished editing my apartment tour video, which I'm uploading tomorrow, so it's already up. And then I got groceries. I'm not gonna do a grocery haul. I'll do grocery hauls once I like know what I'm doing and cooking for one person. I just don't have the hang of it. And then after that, I went to Staples. My computer's out of storage, so I had to get a solid state drive. Hopefully this is the right one because I keep buying the wrong thing and breaking my computer. I had an impulse Facebook marketplace purchase last night after my delicious orange metal shelving that I was so excited about, but I'm happy with this purchase. I actually got delivery through Facebook marketplace. They use a service called Dolly, which other like vintage stores use, so I know it's reliable i just wouldn't be able to bring it by myself nor do i have a car okay so this is messier than it would be normally but i would have to buy a lot of organizational things and i had this in my walk-in closet at my last apartment the shelving and it was always just a mess like it does not i uh, for whatever reason i don't know if it's me or it's just like these types of things in closets. It was so hard to keep organized. For now, since I need more storage in my kitchen, I'm gonna move this to my kitchen. And then the dresser that I got on Facebook Marketplace, I measured and it should fit perfectly and just go up to like here. And then I can have more storage on top, even if I wanna build stuff in. Um, I'm happy with that choice, but now I'm just gonna move all this stuff out um, and move this into the kitchen. So when the movers get here, it'll be easy for them. building is pretty strict with moving. I didn't consider this moving, but they did. So they compromised, but I had to bring this up myself. <laughs> now I have to figure out how I'm gonna get it into my closet in the right way. So wish me luck, folks. <laughs> okay, plan of action is to put down these two feet onto the carpet. Hopefully they're strong enough so that I can tilt this back. Oh God. I have to get it into the closet. It's in the closet. Oh my God. I don't even know how to open that. Oh yay. Okay. I'm banning myself from Facebook Marketplace for the rest of this week. I'm going to dinner with Gavin JC, so I'm gonna pick out an outfit. I have 10 minutes to get ready. I always feel like I have so much time, so I don't get ready, and then I have five minutes to get ready. So here is the outfit. How is my mirror already dusty? I swear I de-dusted it like right before I left. Anyways, here's the outfit. I have a little bow on because I was wearing this t-shirt with red as an undershirt and I didn't feel like changing into an actual undershirt. So we just committed with the red. I have my red cowboy boots on and this Eve's jacket, thread up bag. And that's the fit. I'm gonna hop on the subway and meet the girlies. So excited. <laughs> about four o'clock on Thursday. I didn't really vlog today because I was just doing a lot of stuff on my computer. I had a couple calls, not necessarily boring stuff, but just I wouldn't be able to show you what I was doing. Anyways, today I uploaded the apartment hunting video where I showed you all of the apartments that I toured. And I would say 50% or more of the comments are guessing for a different apartment that I didn't choose, which I didn't choose for 
multiple reasons, but it's interesting to see your guys' guesses. And I'm so anxious to post the next one, which this is all gonna be in the past now if you're watching this real time, but interesting. Um, anyways, tonight I have a something navy event i don't think it's really an event more so just like shopping their new collection i think they're doing a collaboration with the elk which is a really cute coffee shop in the west village um and this event is in the west village so i'm just gonna walk over and then i'm gonna come back here finish the work and random shit that i have to do and then tonight i'm so excited we're having a little girls night at brooke's apartment Still haven't seen her apartment, so I'm really excited. But I just showered, I got most of my work done, I'll do the rest later, so I'm feeling good. Let's get dressed. I also may or may not have gotten myself involved in another Facebook Marketplace thing. <laughs> I'm banning myself from Facebook Marketplace for the rest of this week. Okay. I have an outfit on that I'm pretty happy with. I'm gonna wear my JW Anderson. I'm also so sad because my favorite thrills socks have a hole in the toe. I think the secret to doing this with just bows and no hair tie is using a ribbed ribbon. And then you just tie the bow. I've never done a bow with this long of ribbons, but I think it's kind of fun. All right, let's see. I can't see it, but I'm just gonna trust that it works. All right, and then I kind of have to use a crossbody bag with this jacket because it can't. All right, here is the fit. I'm pretty happy with it. I think it's fun. I will link everything in this outfit in this video in the description. All right, let's go. I had a feeling I'd see you here. I know. So cute. You guys are kind of matching. Same colors. I just got back and the elk sent me home with so many goodies. I'm going to show you. I was the last one standing at this event. So I have acai bowls and these little, I don't know what they're like, muffin situations. I'm so excited. Oh, oh my god. god. Cheers. Cheers. I'm so wow. So we cool. have a little wow wow wow. Just oh yeah, we kind of demolished that. Didn't do they like slide <laughs> into the DMs? That's why I, and I <laughs> Oh yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Do you guys do that? Oh my well, god. It's gonna be out here, so it will be, uh, Yay! Thank yeah. you. All right, guys, we've made it to the end of this vlog. <sighs> Dedicating this one to Facebook Marketplace, even though it did me a little dirty at times, we made it. I want to just do a little recap of the two pieces I got and the one that I have my eyes on, so that moving forward, you guys are part of the story which of these pieces in my apartment. The first piece that I picked up was this orange metal gorgeous storage unit. I was a little bit worried that it was gonna be a file cabinet, but it's not. I guess you could use it as a file cabinet, um, the bottom level, but it has multi-purpose. I got this for $20 and I was so excited because I just ordered an orange rug. Well, it's a cream rug with a hint of orange on it. So I'm really excited to have another orange piece to kind of tie it together. Picking this up was very strange. Um, I asked the seller if they could bring it down just because I didn't feel comfortable just being by myself going to a random person's apartment and she refused. So I ended up caving and I FaceTimed my brother and I went up and got it. Um, but it was really heavy, but managed to get it home. A bit annoying to get home, but it was fine, worth $20. The second item that I picked up, I'm so happy with. I had that metal crate in my closet and it just really wasn't doing it for me. It's so hard to organize that with clothes, at least I found. So I decided to cave and get a dresser. This one that I found, it was $250, which 
for a dresser of that size and quality is a pretty good price. And additionally, because I didn't have a car or somebody else to help me, I decided to pay for a moving service. So Facebook Marketplace is associated with Dolly, so I decided just to use that. That ended up being a little over $100 with tip. That was all going smoothly until I got to my building and my doorman informed me that there would be no way that the movers would be allowed up into my apartment because they didn't have insurance, which was my bad. I should have thought about that and talked to my super beforehand. Had to bring up the piece by myself. It was kind of a disaster, but we did it. I'm glad you guys were there for that. And the third piece is this beautiful dresser. It's a piece that if I were to buy firsthand or from like another seller, it could easily be double the price. So I'm gonna be updating you guys on that piece in the next vlog. So make sure you guys subscribe so you don't miss that. I've been having so much fun during these moving vlogs. So I'm really glad that I'm documenting all of this. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.